Hello everyone, it's I, Meg the Imp. So, we are back with Ascension. Lovely. We met the blacksmith. Now, he wants the his daughter and he, he and his daughter. There we go. He and his daughter had a fight last week and, well, they want... He wants to make up with her and see his grandsons. So, I gotta be the middle person so I can get my daggers. Hey, are you Anissa by any chance? Yes, I am. Your father sent me to talk to you. That's just like him, sending other people to deal with his problems. Uh, what did he offer you? Money? Weapons? How much does this his relationship with me cost to him? Trick question? I'm not sure if I should answer this question. Come on. I'm sorry, this is not your problem. I don't know what I expected you to tell me. Look, I don't have parents. Never had them. But I have a very close friend. And I would give my life to protect her. All I know is that whenever we fight, it's usually because we care about each other a great deal. Sometimes it just means I'm not going to give up on you, so you better change the way you act. That's... Silly. But I guess I will think about it. Thank you. Now is there anything else I can help you with? Come on. I'm looking for a cape. I'm looking for a cape, actually. Something comfortable and light. Oh, a cape? I had just the thing for you. But unfortunately, the last one has been bought by a gentleman who is heading to the Wandering Tree. Alright then, I want to see your shop. You know, I could use some new clothes. Oh, I don't I They might be a little expensive for you. Sister Ding. <laughs> it froze. Lovely. What? Oh, I can't do it. Uh, I can't do them. Forget it. I'm looking for the eagles. I want to know where I can find these eagles, people. I don't know what you're talking about. I love that lip-biting animation that she has. I have to go. Whoa, a note in my pocket? When did it... A friendly advice. Stop asking about the evil eagles. A friend. A friendly advice from a... Friend, I wonder if I should be concerned about the overuse of the word friend. Alright, the wandering tree. Oh wait, was I supposed to come here last? Oh, I don't remember. Oh. Love the music though. And you are welcome once you start paying for your drinks. Uh, come on, Devlin. I thought we were friends. Ah, uh, Jace. We are not. So, are you really going to throw me out, even though I have such great news? What news? I'm going to be a father. Look like... Look like my lady just walked in. Grammar. Mind if you help me out a bit, sweet cheeks? Sweet cheeks? Ah, oh, there you are, you useless bum! You yeah, what? It's time you start acting like a responsible adult. I, uh, what? I'm not letting you see the baby if you keep drinking in taverns and gamble away all our money. Well, I don't even... 
I'm selling flowers all day long, street by street, while you sit and get drunk on ale. I know you were trouble, but I never realized you were this low. Get out of my tavern. You're in big trouble, princess. Watch your back. I'll watch yours instead. Ah, I love it. It's awesome. Down! So cool. Yes. That cape. Persuade. No! Forget it. Ah. I want to be nice. Yeah? How can I help you? Who was that guy? So about that guy. Mm, trouble he is drinking all the ale salt and fights. Usually alone if not with the <laughs> ladies of the night. Any more than that, I have to ask the fellow himself. I'm looking for a friend. He has a nice... New nice looking cape with him. I saw a man with cape. Strange lad. Elf, I think. Hate the moonies. Always staring cold. One minute he was there, the other gone. I'm looking for the eagles. Do you know how I can contact them? What? For the love of all kings. Are you out of your mind, girl? Don't shout their names here. I don't know anything. Shoo. That's all for now. Okay, he's right there. Poor dwarf, he's been losing all his money. I wonder if I should let him win a few times, just to boost his ego. So I can crush it again. It's rare to see a lith in Valand. I thought they all lived in Aldus. They do, but unless you're, like, servitude, but unless you like servitude, hunger, and the constant abuse of the moon elves, Aldus isn't exactly the best place to live as a lith. So you are a refugee. Sort of. Look, it's complicated. Are you familiar with Lith at all? Not really, no. Well, long story short, my people believes that every Lith has a spirit watching over them. When a Lith is born, they are named after the spirit. Kind of like an uninvited guest. As you grow up, your spirit grows up with you. It gives you power and protection if you feed it with positive emotions. Positive what? Look, I know it sounds silly, but you know, the spirits need positive traits in its host to grow up and become powerful. Traits like generosity, bravery, loyalty. If you end up feeding them with negative emotions like envy, anger, vanity, they die. And you become unworthy of the lift. An empty being. It's called an illith. Elith. Pardon. Which means unwanted. They are not accepted within the lith community. How they understand once a lith becomes an elith. It's not understood. It's felt. It's known. It's a lith thing. So I'm guessing you are an elith? Kind of. Actually, I was born here. My parents are elite. I've never even saw Alice, but I don't have a spirit or anything. I wonder if they really have a spirit, though. My parents say they used to feel protected. But think about it. If we were really protected by the spirits, how come the Moonies almost wiped us all up? The game. Hopefully I can get more money. What are you playing? Twisted monkey. Oh, what? Old dwarven game. It's pretty fun beating this guy in his own game. Go easy on him. Never mind. Hey. A garlic. Maybe I could cook something with it? You will. Don't bother me, human. I'm winning this game. No, you're not. Alright, so. Basically, we left off here in the tower. Awesome! Okay, I will see you all guys next time. And see, I even fixed my hair like I said I would, because I'm cool like that. Okay, remember to like, subscribe, comment down below, and I'll see you, my lovelies, in my next video. Bye, y'all. Peace!